Welcome back to Let's Play the Guided Fruit Paradox. Jeez, nighttime already. Maybe I should have ran away. But I mean, it's not possible to run away from a devil. Even if I try to use a police station or the military as sanctuary, it'll only increase the number of victims. Ugh. This kind of situation is, like, seriously not funny at all. How long until the agreed upon meeting? Converting it to this world's sense of time progression. About one more hour? In one hour, we kill the boy's little sister. Yes, that is what must happen. Do you really think the girl will show? She will. I could tell just from looking into her resolute eyes. I see. Then I will trust her as well. Have you heard from Lord Satanael lately? He returned a while ago. He completely annihilated the Archangel forces that were camping in Eustithia Omega-2. I see. With that, us devils now control approximately 80% of the lands. But that man... What does he intend to do after exterminating all the angels? I do not know. However... Whatever decision Lord Satan Isle makes, I will continue to follow him. His strength is truly almighty and without equal. That is true. His power is so great that it cannot be ignored. And there they are again. One more hour. We don't have much time. We need to find the devils in the copy world so I can keep them from harming Minamo. What's wrong, Liliel? You're looking pretty pale. The Archangel forces from Eustidia Omega 2? As far as I know, among the remaining angelic forces, their power was in the top three! And what's his name? Satanael crushed them? I can't believe such a powerful devil exists. Well, you know, for me to be released from my duty as God, I have to beat that guy. Uh, really? No matter how strong you get, that's not going to be possible, Renya. Can't you, like, talk it over or something? I mean, based on what we've seen, those people don't seem all that evil to me. Dork! Those two are devils, you know? They're trying to kill you, remember? It's obvious they're terrible monsters. Still, they're not killing people indiscriminately. I asked them to wait, and they're totally waiting for me. Hey, Liliel, why are angels and devils even fighting this war? W well, um... Because a long time ago, there was, uh, light and darkness, and because of justice and evil, um... You have no idea, do you? Okay, so you have no idea. Y yes I do! Jeez! Devils have killed the innocent and have spread disaster throughout countless worlds! As angels, servants of God, we must destroy those wicked creatures! Uh-huh. Okay, then do it on your own. Why do you all have to involve my brother? Chill out, Minamo. Don't blame Liliel. None of this is her fault. Lord, Miss Minamo... I understand that we angels cannot be forgiven for involving you both in such a selfish war. All I can offer is that I shall remain by my lord's side until my life ends. If I am able to save your life by forfeiting my own, I will do so happily. Liliel. This won't take me an hour. 
Actually, I'm on the next to the last boss floor, so I might as well squeeze uh, some of the next chapter in. How we doing? I'll take that. Doing pretty good, actually, for the most part. I'm getting the stag beetles here. Alright, you slow me down. Scorpion body. You see how they're moving twice now? Missile pod! Whoa! Right here, super fast. Hit Striker, where you have. Can I reach you from here? Yes. Revolution. Hmm, I should have that so I can blow through enemies like that. Oh well. Oop! Some of them are leveling up down there. We can't see if we can get a level ourselves before the boss fight. A lot of you out here. Ooh, that hurt. That actually did damage. Uh... Oop, something beefed. Oh, that's actually using more hitter damage. I don't want to lose my missile pod though. Who knows? I might need that. Uh oh. <laughs> nope. So much for that drop. It's probably another scorpion body, but I don't know if it was level two or not. Don't know if that like switches at all. Whoop! Now you're over here. Anyway, give me that money. Oh, I uh, don't want to take my chances to not take it, and then that thing like opens up and swallows us or something like that, giving us nowhere to go. So, on to the boss. Sorry for the wait. Right on time. I told you, did I not, Varael? You have some nerve, little girl. There is no doubt you are that boy's kid. So, like, you want to make a bet? A bet? The difference between our powers is obvious. Wouldn't it be boring to just kill someone weak like me? So why not listen to my bet? If I can wound either of you, I win. If you kill me first, obviously you win. How's that sound? <laughs> For what reason would we accept such a bet? None, I guess. But I don't think you're gonna kill me just because you like the thought of ripping a young girl apart. Maybe. But if a mortal is able to harm us, I suppose that is reason enough to give you a chance at life. When I pull it off, give me more time. I'll train and train, and get really tough, and then I'll defeat you next time. Defeat me, you say? <laughs> what a grand punchline. <laughs> Indeed. She is interesting, as I thought. Perhaps she should have been the one chosen to become god instead. So, like, do you want to take my bet or not? Sure, that sounds fine. But I will not go easy on you. Not too shabby of me. I'm kind of awesome. It seems like I really might not get killed at this rate. Oh, but when I think about it, there's no way I'll be able to hurt them, is there? Don't sweat it, Minamo. 
That's why your big brother is here. Yes. Even a locked door can be opened with you here to guide people's fates, Lord. And if I guide your fate in the copy world, I'm sure you'll be able to hurt them. But you were killed by that Varael guy, right, Renya? Will I really be okay? Hell yeah, you will. But of course, I have no supporting evidence. Rendering their full data within the Fate Revolution circuit will be the true problem. Yeah. When we were stuck in here with Satanael, we could only get the machine to render a fraction of his data. If Miss Neliel chose this wish for you, I am certain she has countermeasures ready. Let us have faith in her, Lord. So we're leaving the biggest problem up to the shut-in angel who chose this wish? And who I've never met, no less? I'm gonna spew. We wish she shut in because she spent all this time working on this particular moment right now, like you were mentioning. Like we only grabbed like a fraction of Satanael. The other two devils, who know how who knows how powerful they might be if the fate revolution circuit can contain them. Either way. Yeah, just like before. Only a fraction. Not fully materialized. They're not moving, Renya. Don't tell me it's the same as last time. They're too powerful to render inside the copy world? W well Oh my! What about changing the future and saving Miss Minamo? Is there no hope? Galshion! As you surmised, Varael and Frenetti's data is too large to integrate into the machine simultaneously. But as a result of Neliel's research, it has been determined that you may create enough space by deleting cached completed wishes. If you delete the old completed wish data and reload Frenetti and Varael's data in the space you create from that, they can be rendered inside the Fate Revolution circuit in full? So it seems. I cannot speak on the rate of data synchronization, unfortunately. Are you all right, God? We are prepared on our end. I have so many things to say and to ask you, so-called angels. But for now, fine. We'll focus on my sister's wish first. Yes, you may delete Cookie so I can save these two devils in our file. Go ahead and do it. Understood. Oi! Van froze! Huh. It seems they reloaded the data without a hitch. Miss Neliel sure is the best in the business. She was able to render two devils with such immense power without incident. Y you How? Why are you here? Even though you killed me, right? But behold, God is alive, etc. It only took me a week. Wait, no, that's Jesus. Liliel Sotome. I could have sworn I finished you off. I see. So in this world, I was also... Most likely defending him to the death like you mentioned. It is a relief, in a way. It means that I did not run away shamelessly again in order to be the only one who survives. If I was able to die at my lord's side, then I am satisfied. It does not sound as though you have come back from the dead. Then what trickery is this? Are you expecting an answer from me? <laughs> of course not. Power of darkness is this! I can do it! Lilio! Revolution! What a curious boy. Laugh just so I can kill you again, Anthony. Boom! Eat this! Idiot. 
I don't remember getting killed by you or anyone for that matter. I plan to survive in a future different from yours. Renya! Don't worry, Minamo. Let your big brother take care of these bullies for you. Yeah! <laughs> but we already disposed of them once. What fun is there to fall out and simply do it again? I propose a bet. If you are able to defeat my demon horde, you may go. This time. Yes, and you decided to, uh, take her up on it and then play your own. Uh, hold a moment, that... Who cares? I am rather interested in how these two ghosts managed to come back to haunt us. Would it not be a waste if we simply killed them right away? Still, if that is what you said. You'll let us go if I beat up your demon lackeys? <laughs> I'm so grateful, I think I got tears in my eyes. Angels and devils both. I will never bend to either of your wills. Minamo's fate, and my own, everything. I will guide everything to a revolution! Simply fighting lacks excitement, no. Here is an addendum to the bet. Protect your sister! What'd you just do? What's the gimmick? Oh no, she's being pulled in. Please try to calm down. The whirlpool is drawing your sister in. Get her to move far away from it. Keep her away from the whirlpool. Yeah. You are so smart, Lord. Be cautious as you fight. You must also prevent your sister from getting sucked in. Probably attack her too in the meantime. And I ended up feeling this battle twice already. He's either I would die to the enemies there were too much, or I should get with Namo away. Can't let her get sucked in by that book up there. You can take that out, but, uh... I, don't know, I thought it may be easier to focus on the enemies. Hang on, let's equip what I got. Let's see. Gatlings. Hmm. Missile pod. Yeah, I think I'm good. Got plenty of the drops and everything on. The shatter guys are gonna be what comprise the real pain in the ass. I can one shot that, but they can still do damage to me. I, uh. All them, uh. potions I can get for, like, shrooms and everything to restore my energy. Well, that one missed me. Now I have to take out these beetles because they can slow mode me if they hit me. Which I definitely don't want. Shit, I'm getting worked. More. That's a miss. No, that means. Stand my ground. Things get too dangerous, I can god mode and get all my shit back. Ooh, I'll take that. Free healing. You out of here. Let's see, level 35 book. Um, yum yum. Gotta get close to hit. Ooh, here comes these pain in the ass harpies. 
Oop. If I occupy the space, you saw her get, like, blown a little bit further. Or pulled a little bit further, I should say, close to the book. I went back, did all those, uh... Like, ten floors, you get, like, an escape for the, um... What's it called? The Martial Arts Dungeon. I can go back out there easily. I'm gonna get all uh, weapons and such down there. All those level 2, those rank 2 uh, equips and everything so I can like change up the Divinogram. I'm just that much stronger. Some stats add up. She might actually take a hit here. Oh, she's okay. Oh, I'm okay. I should really get you out of danger, though. So you go that way. But if you're off that way, does that mean... Yep, gotta get close. level up. More on the way. Back over there. Looks like whether you guys are okay. Oop! Another beetle. Beetle's gone stag. <laughs> Next move. More than one harpy. Surrounded enemies, let me see. Unless I don't, unless I get rid of that weapon somehow. Oh, wait a minute. Flowing cube. Oh, that's up front, that's not around me. That is. That's what I need. From the hip. There we go. stuff I wanted to bring in initially to be like, okay, this is how I'm gonna win this fight the next time I get down here. And sure enough, I was doing really well and like, I'm like, okay, let me practice before I try this, what you're calling it, and it's like, okay, okay, let's get some more things together. So I have shit ready for, uh, later chapters. Try to take that hit here, yeah. Just to get him close and take him out. I'm tanking through you guys now. Ooh, okay. Didn't even need god mode. Or any of those potions, actually. I just brute force that son of a bitch. Eh. That happens when you piss me off. I decide to go all in. he able to defeat that many demons all by himself? That boy, he is not our equal. Yet to acquire enough power to give us pauses. Why? I killed that boy once, so why is he so powerful? Young one, I know not how you are alive. But I have learned one thing from this. The Fate Revolution Circuit toy that you have created is extremely dangerous. Still, a promise is a promise. I will act as though I did not see you. Power of Duck here! Friend! Farewell, little one. Next time, your life will be mine. Renya! Ow! 
act like they didn't see us, huh? That's quite the gift. Liliel? Hey, Liliel! Uh, are you unharmed, Lord? Yeah, mostly. Enough about me. Are you okay? Are, are you alright, Liliel? Yes. Barely. Thank you very much, Miss Minamo. What... What are... Please take care of my brother in your timeline. M Miss Minamo! Renya has a serious sister complex, you know. He wouldn't leave me alone for, like, a really long time. He depends on me. Uh -oh. Like, I make his lunch every single day and iron his clothes, which he finds a way to wrinkle pretty much immediately. If he isn't being taken care of by a girl like you, Liliel, I'm gonna be worried sick. I might not be able to see him again. At least, the me that exists here, so... So please, take care of Renya for me. Miss Minamo. Yes, I understand. Please entrust your brother to my care. <laughs> you heard her too, Renya. You'll be just fine. Just as you said, Minamo, I might not ever be able to see you again in this future. Even so... Yeah, yeah, ugh. You're gonna say something like, our family bond can surely transcend time, right? Yuck! So embarrassing. Like, totally. Damn it. That was my sentimental touching moment. Don't lose against someone stupid like those devils, Renya. You gotta win, okay? I mean, I won't forgive you if you lose. All right, I'll win. No doubt about it. And I will secure our futures, too. A different future, where you and I will be living happily with Mom and Dad. Yeah, I have faith that you will. Okay, see ya, Renya. I love you. <laughs> I never expected you to actually inflict any damage. Is it rude for me to admit that I am actually happy about the miscalculation? You promised. Give me time to train. No matter how long you train, do you honestly think you will ever be able to best us? Of course I will. I'm Renya Kagurazaka's little sister, you know. I'll win, no doubt about it. And I will secure my future too. I bet Renya would say something like that. Fine by me. As promised, you may have your precious time. I look forward to our next meeting. Variel Nikaido and Funeti Renzuka. When you feel you are finished training, call those names, and they shall be. I'm sorry, Liliel. This is because you had to protect me. No, please do not worry. I did what I am meant to do. Leave Liliel's treatment to me, Lord. There is something else you wish to discuss, correct? Sheriel, you... Forget it. You're right. Please take good care of her for me. Please forgive Neliel, Lord. She had a reason to select that wish. 
She wanted you to know that you could overturn the fate of your death with your own hands. And despite being in the Fate Revolution circuit, you expelled a grand number of powerful foes. We are truly convinced. Only you have the power to defeat Satanael. Man, you sound so damn rehearsed. Is this how you flattered the past gods before you sent them out to die? Oh. About time you take them, rake them over the coals over this shit. Oh my, you already realized it? Well, it would be more odd if you never did think about it. What's up? What are you talking about? Kuroiel, I know you're new to this too, so you probably didn't realize that these angels have created several gods in the past. And then they forced those gods to fight in their selfish war against the devils and let them die. Well, am I wrong? It is just as you say. We have created many gods in the past by using the Fate Revolution circuit. Yes, we have made many different kinds of gods. The woman Raphael still loves, she was also chosen to be God. You roll. Seriously doing something as terrible as that? Why'd you hide it? Hide? We hid nothing. If you had used your brain a little, it should have been obvious. Or maybe you felt the truth poking you in the backs of your minds, but you denied its existence. Maybe you were merely cowards. I... God, we know our actions are sinful. I can offer no excuses or beg forgiveness regarding the gods who have perished. However, know that the coming battle will also decide the fate of all humankind. Should the devils win, the balance between Earth and the Divine Realm will surely be toppled, destroying your world as a result. Is that a threat? Threaten me or flatter me all you want. But it doesn't change the fact that I'm just a high school kid, you know? You are no mere teenager. You hold within yourself the potential to achieve something no god in the past could dream of doing. At least, that is what I believe. No matter what you believe, it's not my concern. I'm going to ignore this burden. It's a bit too much. Future of humankind? The life or death of Earth? Screw that! Even so, I'm still gonna keep fighting. I just wanna get back to my normal life. I swear, I will never make Minamu feel like that again. <laughs> Can you hear me? Preparations are complete. You may fight against God now. Show me who ranks higher, God or Devils. Like with last time, I've already marked your path of entry. As long as you enter between Border Zones T and Y in the Casathelio Frontier, you should have no problem finding the path. Do not underestimate God. He will do his utmost to hunt you down. Now then, Frunetti, I wish you the best of luck. You really do plan to go alone, do you? Yes. I apologize. Why? Uh... Sorry. <clears throat> uh... You really won't say anything else to me? Sorry. This will not be an easy fight. It has been a while since our last encounter. That machine amplifies God's power a great deal. Yes, I am aware. But if we both go... Unacceptable. I must do this on my own. I need to prove that I am indeed a mighty being. I do this to support Lord Satanael. And to stand by your side. I understand. I will say no more. Take care, Variel. I will. Farewell. Ah, 
That's it for today's groceries. Jeez, even if I can slow down long enough to take a breath in this world, it's not calming me down at all. Stupid Liliel. I hope she's recovering without much pain. Ugh, damn it. I can't calm down at all. Renya! Hey, sis. What's up? Uh, to be honest, there's someone I want to introduce you to. Um, what? This may come as a shock to you, and feel free to fall on your knees from surprise, but you have a fan in my middle school! Hmm? No kidding. She was really persistent about getting me to introduce you to her. I mean, it's not like I care that my big brother is popular among a certain demographic or anything. I'm like, proud of you, but I also don't want to see you get all blushy and foot shuffly and crap. <laughs> Got it? Stand up straight and act like a man. Don't gawk at her like she's a zoo animal. And like, seriously? Try not to drool? You got it. And now, the appearance of the mysterious, beautiful girl! Come on out, Shiratori! Oh no! Ah. Hey, you watch that! I'm still looking at that tea writing. Uh, um, it's nice to meet you, Mr. Minamo's older brother. Sir, I I'm Manael Shiratori. You! I'm so sorry! I asked such a selfish and impossible thing of Minamo! But, um... Well, I have certain feelings for you, Renya! I called him Renya! Uh. I can't do it! Minamo, I'm so embarrassed! Did you just fucking Ugu? Shiratori? Oh, okay, I'll do my best. Yeah, my very, very best. But not will stop helping her. <sighs> I've... I, I've always had feelings for... for you, Renya. So, please take good care of me. Pass. Tits. <laughs> what? Are you stupid or something? Oh, hell no! Renya, you're gonna say no to a cute girl who looks like a friggin' doll? And you refuse so fast. Dude, like, what a waste. Minamo, your brother is going to have a serious talk with this girl for a minute. Please, get out of earshot. Huh? Why? Not open for discussion. Just go over there. Shoo! 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 You're so lame. What was with that Mr. Brother crap? What could you possibly gain from putting on such a ridiculous act? <laughs> Did you enjoy my farce? I don't think I'm benevolent enough to enjoy knowing that it's all an act. Aw, do not be so mad, Mr. Minamo's older brother. You must learn to be N-I-C-E to G-I-R-L-S. Why is there a star in heart? My divine instincts are telling me that I will be forgiven if I punch you square in the face right now. Your little sister is sheepishly watching from a distance. If you do not mind her seeing it though, please do as you like. <laughs> She's giving you a free shot, take it! I'll explain everything later. <laughs> then let us descend to hell once more. I shall lift the curtains to reveal a bloodbath again tonight. Oh, if this game gave me the option to just slug her. Lord, the shop that allows you to change the colors of your equipment is now open. That's... Kinda lame. <laughs> I don't know if you can just do it with all what you call it. I think it just has to do with, like, ranks you've unlocked. That has to be a color you've already been privy to, yeah. Say. I can change this to... If I want to. But then I'd be confused as to... 
Now it just confuse me unless I rename everything, and I'm gonna get all sorts of level two items now. So hopefully you're okay. Liliel, how are you feeling? Oh, I am very sorry for making you worry about little old me. As you can see, I am a okay now. Myself aside, I feel at fault for involving you in all this, Lord. Seriously, don't worry about it. This isn't your fault at all. I would say that my so-called destiny began at birth. I was given absolutely terrible luck with lotteries and such. But Lord... Just feel better for me. That depressed expression doesn't suit you at all, Liliel. S still Wait. I have something else to say. No matter the debt you feel toward me, don't do something ridiculous like protect me by using your own body ever again. The last thing I ever want to see is you getting hurt because of me, Liliel. But but it's my duty as your personal angel. I'm supposed to protect you. I've heard that one already. I hereby forbid you from taking any more self-sacrificial actions for my sake. B but there's no way I... Ugh, enough already. Can't you understand the simple heart of this simple young man? I don't want to be protected. I want to protect you. I want to protect Liliel. Got it? Me? Wh what are you saying right now? I don't know what it is you're saying, and it makes no sense, and... Floodgates opened. Uh, um, uh, uh, the, the coping strategy for such an outburst is... Um, m my handy-dandy manual has to... Uh, um, it ain't in there, I bet you. What a ridiculous habit. Whipping out that manual whenever something happens. You should have stopped doing that by now. Now then, God, I have chosen your wish to grant. Are you prepared for it? Either way, I have to get it done, right? <laughs> Correct. If you manage to return safely, I may give you a kiss as your reward. Like I said before, pass. It'd obviously be the kiss of death. <laughs> now then, God. Take care. I wish you the very best. Yuck. A kiss, huh? I wonder if she'll ever get sick of teasing me. Miss Lanael was acting a little bit different than she normally does. Really? She seemed the same to me. I hope it was merely my imagination. What are you going to do now, Lord? I'm gonna guide some fates, of course. No matter what kind of wish Lanael picks, my end goal remains the same, you know? I see. However, now that you have learned about Celestia's plan, Lord, my seniors will be pushing you even harder. I will do my very best to support you and be a useful ally. Even so, be careful. Yeah, and seriously, Liliel, don't do anything rash. Hallelujah! Today's another beautiful day. Look at that gorgeous blue sky. On a day like this, there's no question that something amazing is going to happen. Oh, that made me think of a haiku.
beautiful blue skies. I so want to eat pudding like right this instant. Yo! Yep, it checks out. Uh, yep. That should do it. Well done, me. Yeah. Uh, what? That dude was pretty flashy. He must be the believer. So he wants to eat pudding? If we stuff some into his face, would that answer his prayer? Um, I do not think that is the case. Well, I mean, this is a wish that Lanael chose. It's gotta have some awful side to it. Still, this is pretty chill scenery. It feels kind of like, uh, paradise? It is a paradisiacal atmosphere, surely. But something is off. It is almost too beautiful, like an artificial garden. Something's off, huh? If I may be quite candid, it is sketchy. Yes, an indescribable feeling of super sketchiness. Sketchy, all right. That flashy dude looked sketchy to me, definitely. Lesson 7. Project Sanctum. Ooh, we got trees all over the place. <laughs> I forget I have that equipped on you, oh my god. Oh my god, he just... <laughs> Adios! Uh oh. I better hurry and kill these things so I can get strong enough to take them on. What are all these trees? Oh, they drop stuff. Oh. Oh, and okay. All right, so trues drop things. More lemons. I think there's one for the orange and the grape too. But when they turn red, they do damage, because I heard that go off. Just gotta go around collecting things. Wait, did I miss one? What does the grape do? Defense. Oh, a shop! kill all them yet. And it's just stuff I have already, so, yeah. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> Gotta go back to what you get like the really rare shit. Good. Martial arts dungeons. Oop. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, jeez. Gotta make it back over that exit into the next area. Isn't that the sketchy dude we were talking about before? He's completely surrounded by aberrations. I gotta get in there and... I gotta get in there! Please wait a moment, Lord. Huh? What's up, Liliel? Please take a good look at the aberrations. They may look like brutal creatures, but... Well, just look. They aren't attacking? Rather, they look domesticated. Huh? He's coming toward us. Welcome to my perfect garden. It's been a while since a guest last came to visit. Since you're welcoming me, it makes it easier to get to the point. I'm God. I've come to answer your prayers. <laughs> God, you're God, are you? Shun the non-believer! Man, 
It really is a nice day today. I knew you'd be coming, but I never thought you'd actually call yourself God. What a pleasant miscalculation. Perhaps you may even entertain me more than I expected. Hey, what are you... Lord, allow me. I cannot ignore your comments, good sir. What did you mean when you said that you knew that God would be coming here today? Whoa, chill out, scary girl. Don't stare at me with such determined eyes. Please, give me an answer. Depending on what you say... God, you will die in my garden. Huh. This is pretty interesting. I thought you'd be more shocked. Did you, for some reason, happen to look into your futures? Who, who are you? Oh, <laughs> who cares about me right now? Rather, you're my guest. Allow me to give you a tour of my precious garden. So? It's pretty cute, isn't it? This one's my most recent favorite. Do you think you can win, God? Huh? Didn't you hear me? I asked if you'd be able to win. Well, I don't intend to lose against anyone or anything. I have something that I need to do. <laughs> Look at how brave you are. So, in addition to my garden tour, why not play along with my game? Try not to be deceived by this man's nonsensical talking, Lord. You're far too cautious, young lady. You came here to answer my prayer, no? Uh, yeah. Then it is simple. I will test you to see whether or not you are worthy of answering it at all. D demanding to test the Lord? Our God? There are limits to how impertinent a believer may be. Ah, <laughs> impertinence, huh? That's really all you can come at me with. Will you play my game or not? If I am to answer your prayer, there's no option besides playing along with your so-called game, is there? Right. And then, you will die. I will not die here, ever. Can you prove that? Naturally. I'll show you right now. Good. This is truly a day that will not bore me. Who is this guy and how does he know what we were doing in the revolution circuit? There is something serious to this guy going on. Looks like I'm wearing an overcoat or something like that. Wait, that's my tactical vest. That's what that is. Two magical potions. Hey. If anybody likes to get spamming with their spells, I can throw that on. Oh, his name is Cloudy. Wow, that's imaginative. Just after this gold guy. I would not let him escape. Actually, he's doing a pretty good job at escaping. Oh, he's made it over here. Oh, he's on the run again. Oh, he got him again, though. And dead. And... Oh, no. Oh, he healed just in time. <laughs> oh, wow, there's enemies all over the place. Hang on. Oh, it hurts the enemies, too. Okay, they stay even longer. Goes from green to purple, and then I assume they just... After a while, like the, uh... The librarian's little trap again, they just... Yep, there they go. And then they reset. Okay. Ow. Didn't see that. I'm gonna get those... Shoes. Ooh, damn it. 
here with that. I was over here this whole time. Oh, this camera. What? Oh, I see. Elevated platform. That's something I already had. I can't get it to. That's gonna be annoying. Unfortunately, that heals you. Oh, jeez. Already getting hungry. These things are all over the place now because of all the. This might be a pretty good place to grind. Although it's hard to sue the enemies from the water call. That's gonna be a, that might be a problem here. Oop, nope, we'll go past. Here's the exit. I was just gonna show us off a little bit more before I end it off and say see you next time on Let's Play the Guided Foot Paradox.